Hey, man. Hey, bro. Throw in? Yeah. Maury, Maury, sh no, no, Maury, Maury, no, I, I got the money, seriously, that's not the issue. No, I just want to make you happy. Is, is there anything else my team can do for you? No, we do events, parties. <laughs> no, anything you like, just, just give it a think. All right, bye-bye. What a dick. What's up, T? Oh, I don't want to think about what's up. Come on, there's something I got to take care of. Think, think. Ah. Head down to Dragonheart in Chinatown. Take this gun, Luis. Just in case. Just in case? Oh, this is some sci-fi shit. I know a guy who gave me a deal. What can I say? It helps to be prepared. Tony, man. We're going to Chinatown? Really? What? We got business. Tony, you know what you like on the MSG. Those fucking headaches. You won't leave the house. More for a fucking air bro. I hear your beer. Oh, I'm glad you care. It ain't that I care. It's that I can't take the money. Well, we're not heading out for dim sum. Rocco's asked to talk to someone. The rent guido pretended to be a gangster. Now I wish we were getting takeout. Hey, we're in debt to the kid and his uncle, and he's got the ear of one of the most powerful families in the city. We gotta at least pretend to play ball. In that case, I guess my brother is in good hands. You take care of that prick. It seems the definition of family loyalty differs in your country. The marketplace has a value for everything, and I guess that a disloyal Jew bastard ain't worth shit to me, brother or no brother. Such are the heady joys of consumer capitalism. A system that's flaws are becoming increasingly evident. Ah, <laughs> that's right, I forgot. You little yellow people are commies too, huh? Both sides of the fence? You know, I grew up watching your kind getting killed on the TV. Hell of a show. I'm sure, but perhaps the show wasn't as much fun as the reality of that war. Hmm, perhaps not. Now I bid you farewell, sir, and don't do all that smack at once. On second thought, you know, go ahead. Do. Boo. Hey, watch it, you greaseball fuck. I apologize for our associate's uncouth manner. I can only say that our partnership with him is one of necessity, not volition. Please, you must be the famous Tony Prince. Ah, uh, notorious, maybe. This is Luis Lopez, my business partner. Hey. Mr. Pelosi has led me to expect much from this meeting. Ah, yeah, about that. Rocco has a tendency to promise more than he can deliver. He said it must have been weaned too early. Yeah, we're not weaned at all. As you can see, we are already behind schedule on this project. We need you to, uh, how do I put this, to uh, clear things with the planning department and to ease some licensing troubles. Hey, look, we're not lawyers, okay? We run nightclubs, pretty badly, too. We got enough trouble keeping the licenses on our own clubs, okay? We don't do licenses. Before I was being polite, Mr. Lopez, but I do not have to be. Mr. Pelosi made it clear that you are not in a position to choose who you help and who you do not. Yeah, well, that kid's got a big mouth, okay? And he ain't in no position to be writing checks for us, okay? We are not going to be able to help you, period. 
Let's go, Tung. Sorry to waste your time, Mr. Um, you are not going anywhere until we have an arrangement. No, I'm afraid we are. There is no arrangement. You got a problem? Take it up with your boy Rocco. <laughs> you are not negotiating column inches and bar tabs, you insolent fuck! We are serious people! <laughs> really? Hmm. Yeah, really! <clears throat> what is wrong with you? I was supposed to be the irrational idiot with the anger issues. I got anger issues, okay? The guy threatens to shoot me because I can't arrange a liquor license for him. Please, give me a break, T. Oh, God. Oh, shoot. They're coming for us! They heard that shot! Back. They're fucking coming! For my ancestors! Stick by me, bro. Yo, calm the fuck down! Luis, will you do me the honor? Oh, shit! Tony, get over here. Aiming right for us! Get down! down. yourself. I'm soaked through. I must have lost three pounds in sweat. Yeah, don't go looking for a right side. Rocco's big mouth nearly got us killed. Fuck! You gonna call Rocco then? Conversations are usually Tony's department. Well, Mr. Tony gave me your number. There are some other matters I need to discuss before we get down to the real shit. Hey, if Tony gave you my number, then it's okay, bro. Great! Come hang out at my apartment. It's right on the middle park. Prime location. 
One of the most exclusive in the city. Top dollar shit. You'll love it. Yeah, all right. I'll be by sometime. Just don't wait up. <laughs>